Why am I so close? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Mr. Tastic. Let me. Oh, there we go. Just that. So you can look at my whiteboard in the corner. Oh, I'll stand right there. Whew. All right. I'm Mr. Tastic. And in this video or tutorial, remember when I said, oh, yeah, it is day eight of the June drawing bonanza. I said yesterday, and yesterday, which was day seven, uh, when we were doing the dead strawberry, um, that day eight would get weird, and it did. It's a, it is a zombie watermelon, obviously leaking water all over the ground because it's a watermelon. Hello. So grab something to draw with and something to color with and let's make some art. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, hello and welcome back. This is the Ms. Artastic YouTube channel. We're going to be continuing our June drawing bonanza. So if you've just shown up for the first time, we are doing a drawing every single day for the month of June on the Ms. Artastic YouTube channel. I'm gonna be dropping a new video every single day in the month of June. Um, all summer themes, super fun, get into the summer vibes, but also you're gonna be seeing yourself going from here in your drawing skills all the way up here because you are showing up and drawing with me and practicing your drawing skills every single day. And the cool thing is you can grab anything you want to draw with and anything you want to color with. It's really up to you on what, how you make your mark. That is your choice. Of course, you can always add your own artist flavor to that. I always encourage that you add your own spin to it. So if you don't like how I'm doing something or if you want to add more to it, that is a cool thing is that you are encouraged to add your own artist flavor. And of course you can share your designs on social media, tag me at Ms. Artastic or at Artastic.kids. I have both accounts. Um, or use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic. That is hashtag MS Artastic. And I will see you, uh, see your artwork that way. And then we can all check out how we come together as a community and how we make all our art different from each other. So today we are on day eight of the drawing challenge. If you need to catch up, you can go back into previous episodes and check them out there. And we are going to be doing a zombie watermelon today. And we are going to be starting with a big sweeping U shape. Give it some gaps, give it some gaps. Give it some gaps. All right, on these gaps, we're gonna make missing pieces. It's a zombie, it's decaying, guys. And let your hand get loose. We need loose hands today. Ugh. Loose hands to make some zombie lines, okay. This side's kind of fresh and then it's gonna get mushy. You know how watermelon, when it gets in the fridge, it starts sitting there too long in the fridge and it starts getting that like the water escapes and it starts becoming mushy. That's what's happening, guys. Okay, let's add some crazy zombie leaves here. Arr! Gotta add some sound effects on your art. Hey, um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, uh, make sure you do that, please. It helps me continue to draw. Otherwise, I'm drawing for no one, guys. If you want me to show up here and draw, you gotta subscribe. It helps me out, helps me improve analytics, which helps my videos get seen, it's the only way. Um, so it really is important that you subscribe if you haven't. And that way I can continue to draw for you. Yeah. Provide you with some free art lessons. Okay, we got some crazy vine leaves going on in this slice of watermelon. Okay, we're gonna add the rinds. We're gonna do one, two lines here. The rest is all kind of missing in chunks. You know, actually maybe we'll, maybe some chunks are just like falling off. We'll add some like icebergs down here of watermelon chunks. Ah, my pieces are falling. Maybe there's like water escaping. That's the sound of water escaping, obviously. All right, look at that. Maybe it's dripping 
leaking water out of a watermelon because it's a zombie. See, this is the cool thing about art. You just make up things as you go. There's really no rules. That's what makes us interesting, you know? Just make it up and hope the difference between this and AI, AI generated art, is I'm just making it up as I go and I'm, I'm having fun doing it, right? I'm having fun creating it. That's what's cool. That's why we're doing this. It's the why. So art, no, artists are never gonna become obsolete because, well, it's fun to do this. <laughs> That's the point. I like to do it, so I'm gonna do it, right? All right, what else? Oh yeah, there's no face or seeds. Okay, we'll do a face. Okay, one circle on one side. Make it thick border, thick border. Zombie watermelon, thick border. And on the other side, thick border. Weight on the inside. Big upside down U with corners going tucked in. And we'll bring it up like a jelly bean, just like that. Yeah. Oh, guys, it's not even moldy yet. We have to make it moldy still. Don't let me forget about that. Okay, letter M on the inside of the mouth. Give it some teeth with some zigzag lines because why not? Remember, we're not AI. We're just making it up as we go. We don't have to scan the internet for ideas. Well, we can. We do, I guess, that as well. But we can. We're having fun. That's all that matters. Add some lines around the eyes. Give it some expression. Do it on the mouth too. Maybe it's drooling. Oh my gosh. Watermelon drooling water. Okay, I need some mold. Add some little fluffy mold fungus going on here. Cause you know, when veggies start going bad, they go moldy. Hello. There we go. That's just weird. Oh yeah, this chunk should be moldy too. It lost its piece. Okay, add some seeds. Add some seeds. I'm just coloring in some ovals here. I'm gonna need a new marker. Pretty quick, guys. Look at this thing. Nothing lasts anymore, I swear. Sharpie, you're an artist loft. Um, just saying. I'm very annoyed, Artist Loft. One, you've jacked your prices up by $2 on every single one of these markers. That's six bucks one for one. Six dollars. Number two, Artist uh, Loft. That, these aren't lasting any longer, so. I'm letting you know that I'm angry at you. Okay. What else? Oh yeah, let's add some seeds on the ground. Boom. Check that out. That's a zombie and a half. Drop the mic, AKA a Sharpie. Sharpie chisel tip, my favorite size. Makes a bold mark, but not lasting as long, Sharpie. I'm, I'm looking at you too. You and Artist Loft, same category right now. Okay, next, coloring it in. Let's do it. So grab something to color with. Your choice of our making medium and your choice of colors, and go ahead and color in your zombie watermelon. And of course, I'm gonna be leaving a little bit of white here along the top for some shine of light. Bought all these markers yesterday, and now they're almost dead.
And once you're done, your zombie watermelon is done. Well, that's it for this episode. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, Ms. Artastic. And if you create anything and share it online on social media, please, please, I would love to see it. So take me at Ms. Artastic and I will check it out or join the community and conversation and use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic. And I will check it out that way as well. And you can see what other people are creating who create with Ms. Artastic. YouTube videos. Well, that's it for this episode and I will see you in the next.